Hi, hello and welcome to another session with your designer by design. In this video, we'll go over installing a fully activated Microsoft Office 2021 version. To start with, open a browser and search for Office Customization Tool. It should be on the top of the search result. Click on it and it would take you to Microsoft 365 Apps Admin Center. This allows you to pick and choose your deployment settings. The first one is to pick your architecture. To find out what is your computer's architecture, open File Explorer. Here, right click on this PC and go to Properties. This tells you what your system type is and the architecture. Now you know what option to choose from. Minus 64-bit, select US. Now the next one is you need to pick a product. For the Office Suits, select Office LTSC Standard 2021 Volume License. You also have options to install Visio or Project but I don't use them in my personal computer, so I'm going to pick them as none. For additional products, if you speak any other language other than English, go ahead and pick your language back. I'm going to skip that. For the update channel, leave the default selection. And let's keep the version as latest. Okay. Next, you have the options to select what apps you want as part of this deployment. Enable or disable the apps of your choice. Next, you need to select the primary language. I'm going to select US English. And if you choose to add your local languages, you can add the respective languages. Click on next and here you have the options for installation. We can use just the default options here and click on next. For the update and upgrades, if you have any of the existing products already installed and want to get that uninstalled, you can uh, select those. Next, in the licensing and activation, let's leave the default option as KMS, okay? When you choose Mac, you have to provide a license key. Obviously, we don't have one. So let's go with KMS. Click Next. And here in the general information, I'm going to type the channel name. You might want to put your name. Description is optional. I'm not going to touch any of the application preferences. Go ahead and click finish. Here it displays all the choices that we made. Now go ahead and click on export button. It prompts you for the file format. Select Office Open XML Formats and click OK. In the next prompt, select the checkbox and accept the terms and give a preferred file name. I'm going to leave the default as configuration and then click on export. You should see that configuration.xml is now available in your download folder. Okay, our first step is to get the configuration file and it's ready now. The next step is open a new tab and search for Office Deployment Tool. It should be the top on the search result. Click on it. In this screen, go ahead and just click on the download button. This saves the file in your download folder. 
Now go to your download folder and pick these two files, configuration.xml and the office deployment tool executable, and maybe move it to a folder on your desktop. I'm going to create a folder called Office 2021 and move them here. Now, select the Office Deployment Tool Executable, right click and select the option to run as administrator. In this screen, accept the license terms and click on Continue you need to select where you want the files to be extracted. I'm selecting the Office 21 folder and click OK. The files are extracted successfully. You can see that in the folder. Next, search for command prompt and run as administrator. Now, we need to run the command from the Office 2021 folder that we created. Okay, so type the command to change the directory, which is cd followed by the full path of Office 21 folder. So now we are in the right folder. Now we need to run the setup file command. So the command goes dot slash setup dot exe space slash config space configuration dot xml. I will also type this command in the description. Okay, hit enter and the installation should begin. The installation might take few minutes. Make sure you stay online and have enough power for your computer. If you had a successful install, don't forget to click on the three dots and select Thanks. Okay, the installation is complete. Now you can use your MS Office. I'm going to open Excel. From the file menu, select account and you will see the product activated. Don't forget to click on super thanks and don't forget to subscribe to designer by design.